What's up guys? Let's talk about batteries. Put a 36 volt Husqvarna 4.2 amp hour. Quick plug. Sponsored by me. Teespring merch store. Cool barrows. On shirts. XR6 on shirts. Etc. Phone covers. Hoodies. It's getting cold in America right now. Teespring one up sleeve customs in the video description down there anyway something cool I went to the battery guy today and the battery guy had batteries strangely enough this is a Husqvarna 4.2 amp hour 36 volt lithium it has the red light of death giving us all kinds of warnings it says 2017 on the side of it so this would commonly be used in Chainsaws, yard equipment, that kind of stuff. I believe my mate's got 36 volt stuff. So I'll have to confirm with him. I've already taken the screws out. Judging by the dust, I'm going to say chainsaw. You know, it's a, that's an oily chainsaw kind of dust for sure. Now, my battery guy that I get some of these batteries from is recycling plastics. So I need to start learning how to grade plastics. So as I do that, I'll bring you guys along, teach you how to grade plastics because he's melting them down and making stuff out of them. Okay. So that's our red light of death. Now, I tested it across the terminals. There they are. I'll just see if I can show. I tested it across our two terminals here. Which are kindly marked positive and negative, which is great. 39 volts. Nothing wrong with this 36 volt battery. So the cells inside here almost goes as a given. You're going to be fine. PC slash ABS. What's PC stand for? Polycarbonate? Well, it's pretty, pretty simple. What have we got? It's solid right the way through. Danger, do not use outside of pack. Sony Energetic, US 18650 UTC4. Just Google that real quick and I'll come back. Okay, from my quick Google, we have Sony VTC4s, which are 2000 milliamp, so they're not high current, are uh, not high, uh, capacity, but they're 30 amp cells. Explain their uh, explain their usage here. So it looks like we've got four by four. Traditionally, it was 36 per 10. You only got 10, don't you? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah. So they're 2,000 milliamp cells. I don't know how they get 4.6, oh, 4.2 amp hours, whatever. Sounds better than four, doesn't it? Four flat sounds like, you know, maybe Ryobi wrote four flat on theirs, and then the 4.2 sounds better. So yeah. That's what's inside. Reasonably good insulation. It's all potted. See, it's all good, like a conformal coating. It's even got the Husqvarna symbol in the middle. Yeah, it's good coating. So, evidently there's a BMS failure, which has caused our problemos. It's two wires in there cut off. Can you guys see that? Yep. I wonder where they're meant to go. There's two pins in the center of that as well that aren't going anywhere on this. I don't know. It's a bit strange. So obviously in this coating in here is a battery management system. In the insides, 
Then in there, uh, T8s, T10s. Must be T. Must be T. Eights, I reckon, because that is a T10. So there's T8s down in here if you need to get one apart. Is there any in the front or is it all just BMS? Not in the middle of the front. Under that terminal and under that terminal. So yeah, at some stage, now that I know that that's um, charged, at some stage I'll pull that apart and just harvest it for itself. Um, but yeah, now that I know my mate's collecting certain types of plastics, I'll get a list. Apparently anything good is classified. And it's got it written on it, so. That's kind of cool to know. PC, polycarbonate. Yeah. So yeah, you can buy these cells. They're saying that they're $4 a piece US. That sounds a bit expensive. I'm sure you can find them cheaper than that. How many photos do you need of an 18650? <laughs> VCT3, 1600 milliamp and 30 amp discharge. That's cool. I mean, if you're looking for a high output one, they tell you how to find it. Anywho, that's all this video was about. Just having a look inside this cell. Got another one over there that I'm going to get out and uh, do, and we'll check out what cells are in it and see what's going on. I've never opened one before, but it's a Dewalt flex fold, so I'll uh, make that a separate video. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one. I need to clean up my desk. I know. No one pointed out. I know. Look at it. The worst part is like multi levels of crap everywhere. All good. Thanks for watching. Buy some merch. If you're buying something on eBay or you're buying something on Banggood, if you just go to it from my link, it affiliates it. Be sick if you could do that. I want to buy some more cool stuff for the channel so that we can uh, play with more things. Plastic recycling coming soon. Catch you on the next one.